So I'm on my way. We have winds around 15 knots, gusting up to 20. And we are going downwind. I have the mainsail up with one reef on the mainsail. I had also half of the headsail up, but I took it in because uh, it was just bluffing. Uh, it, would, it wouldn't do anything anyway. Uh, we were doing a six knots speed. Now we're a little down to five. The winning went maybe down to 14, 13 knots, but it's coming up again. The more we go away from land, the more waves we're getting also now, because the wind is coming from behind us. So we are rolling a lot. That is beautiful and the weather is wonderful. And we have, uh, should be four hours in all or something to be there. Yeah, to Österhorup. Well, the wind went down just a bit. Uh, we are still doing like a, almost five knots anyway. Um, we are sailing in three meters deep water. It's not more than three meters deep here. Maybe four, maybe. Uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a huge patch of low water in this area. But of course, uh, it's no problem. Uh, my draft is one and a half meter. So no problem. I have to go really, really keep an eye on the boat because um, it's swinging a little to the port and starboard, sailing downwind, and the waves are coming a little from the side, from behind. So from the corner of the boat. So um, I have to really, really keep an eye on the mail sail, so we're not booming. And uh, that will be not disaster, but uh, that's not good for the equipment here. Things can go wrong, things can break down. But uh, the sun keeps going and coming back. And uh, we are rolling. This is how it is to go to sail downwind. All is good. Well, the wind is not that strong anymore, but uh, I get a lot of uh, waves, sometimes big waves coming, kind of a swell maybe, I should call it. I'm passing Maria, Maria Fiore. I, I was going with the mainsail, but the boat was rolling a lot and I was constantly in danger of booming. So I decided to fall off a little from my course. So I'm going a few degrees to the port now. Uh, maybe like, um, I don't know, 15 degrees to the, uh, to the port. In that way I can also use my head sail. And actually I'm getting a little more speed now and the board is more stabilized. And um, it might not be that the uh, Peak of a compromise ever anyway because I'm I'm getting more speed and um, I'm gonna end up going a little zigzag. I'm gonna be jibing a few times before I reach the destination, but uh, it might be the same time anyway, just longer, <laughs> and at least I don't have the danger of booming all the time constantly. So, yeah, let's see how this is going to turn out to be.
some arriving in Östehoro. Yeah. Yeah, I got my hook ready because I was uh, planning to lay on this boys out there. But uh, now it's out of the season, so there is space to lay alongside. So I'm laying really good here. I've been here many times before, and they have a very good fish place here to eat some good fish. It's just. Just out there. Just gonna order and bring it and eat it in the boats. Yeah! It's been a good trip, but uh, tricky, tricky, tricky. Because I was rolling a lot and uh, I was in danger, constant danger, a lot to have a booming. So, but I managed, I did some, I tried various things and I took the last. Uh, half hour or so with the engine so relaxing time now morning it's a beautiful day sunshine for the moment but it's gonna be a bit cloudy today and maybe rain in the afternoon that's why I'm gonna get ready and get on my way today I'm going from Östehorup to Hals it takes around two and a half hours and then I'm home <laughs> Yeah, departure time. I'm leaving now from Mr. Horup. Uh, the sun is just about to go away now, it gets more cloudy. And now we're sailing and just turn off the motor. It's not much wind, maybe four, five, six knots. Uh, we are doing just over three knots of speed, but uh, it's okay, it's okay. The sun just comes through sometimes through the clouds, but it's, I know it's gonna be cloudy day. The rest of the day is supposed to, that's the forecast. And uh, probably, probably some rain late afternoon, but uh, Hopefully by then I will reach uh, Hals Harbor. So the last trip back home after being away for a few days. It goes pretty good here. Same conditions pretty much. The wind goes a little up, a little down. So, but we have been keeping speed of uh, four knots but now we're doing a uh, five actually today is the best sailing day I have had for the last four days that I have been out sailing uh, calm seas uh, nice breeze nice sailing good speed not sunshine but the sun comes through the clouds so it's pretty much and then uh, you see I'm I am with a t-shirt actually it's not it's not cold so it's great so we should be arriving in the harbor in a, actually in about 45 minutes if we keep that speed so now i'm back to familiar grounds now this is my sailing grounds i know the area Today and not Now we just turn into Linfjord. We just passed the uh, salt and pepper, a little lighthouse there. And we're heading to the harbor. I should be there in about 15 minutes. 
and the weather is turning darker now. So I arrived at the uh, home harbor. It took uh, two hours and 45 minutes. Uh, it was around 12, 13 uh, nautical miles. So my whole five days sailing trip is over for now. I had a wonderful time. Uh, met some people, some friends, and uh, had a really good sailing. So the boat is put to rest now. So now I'm gonna pack my things and drive home. If you want to follow me, please subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell, so you can always get a notification every time I upload a new video. Thanks for watching, see you next time. Bye.